now we are seeing about heat synapses introduction definition effects of heat transfer of heat in this transfer of heat there are three types conduction convection and radiation concept of temperature conclusion introduction all substance in our surroundings are made up of molecules these molecules are generally in motion and kinetic energy the sum of the kinetic and potential energy is called internal energy of the molecules this internal energy when flows out is called heat energy definition of heat heat is the form of energy that is transferred between systems or objects with different temperature flowing from high to low temperature it is also referred as heat energy heat is measured in calories or joules effects of heat expansion change in state change in temperature chemical changes change in state enough heat can change the substance state melt a solid evaporate a liquid once a substance reaches its melting or boiling point more heat is needed to make it change state change in temperature temperature is the measure of the average kinetic energy of an object to raise the temperature of an object you have to put energy into the object the higher in the specific heat the more energy is takes to heat up the substance chemical changes these are example for chemical changes the wood log before during the log getting burn after it gets a new substance pile of ash transfer of heat three types first one conduction convection radiation these are the videos of transfer of heat When you keep an object near a burning wood, it becomes hot because of heat transfer. In this video, we will learn about different ways in which transfer of heat can take place. Heat can be transferred from one object to other by conduction or convection or radiation. When heat from one object gets transferred to other object by direct contact, it is known as conduction. For example, when we make tea, heat from stove gets transferred to steel pan because of direct contact, and thus this is conduction. When you iron your clothes, heat energy gets conducted from iron to clothes. In convection method, movement of particles of liquid or gas cause transfer of heat from heat source. Let's take an example of pot of water. As we heat it, water particles near the heat source gets heated first we know that addition of heat causes increase in movement of particles thus these particles move randomly and a relatively empty space is formed to fill this space particles from far areas move here again these particles acquire heat energy and move away this process goes on and whole water becomes hot in conduction and convection there is a medium in which heat gets transferred but there is no medium between sun and earth still we get heat from it when heat transfer takes place without any medium it is called radiation you must have seen people sitting around the fire here too heat is transferred in the form of radiation In fact every hot body radiates heat and becomes cold Let's take an example of boiling water on a stove From stove heat conducts to pot as it is directly in contact Due to convection all the water particles receive heat If you bring your hand very close to side of the pot you will feel little hotness This is because radiations coming from pot. Now you understand the transfer of heat. There are three types: conduction, convection, and radiation. Transfer of heat. Heat is transferred from one place to another till the temperature becomes equal. Heat transfer takes place. when heat energy flows from an object with high temperature to low temperature these are the examples of heat transfer of heat first one conduction the process of 
transfer of heat in solids from a region of higher temperature to the region of lower temperature without the actual movement of molecules is called conduction examples of conduction the heat from a hot coffee makes the cup itself hot a metal spoon becomes hot from the boiling water inside the cup conduction in daily life conduction sort takes place when there is temperature difference between the objects metals are good conductors of heat in conduction liquid and gases also conduct heat but very slowly conduction is a slow process heat is conducted if the area of the object is large convection convection is the flow of heat through a fluid from place of higher temperature to the places of lower temperature by the movement of the fluid itself these are the convection process now the cooler air goes to the sand goes to the sand then warms air then the cool air convection in daily life breeze in the afternoon the surface of the land near the sea is warmer as compared to in the evening this warm air near the land is readily replaced by the cool air resulting in sea breeze when it night the tendency of land to cool down is more once this air rises it is replaced by the cool air from the land which is commonly referred to as land breeze hot air balloon for example the principle of convection the heater at the base of the balloon the heater heats up the air which moves upward the hot air which rises get trapped inside the balloon and causes the balloon to rise up to this is the example for hot air balloon third one radiation radiation is the method of heat transfer that does not require particles to carry the heat energy in this method heat is transferred in the form of waves from hot object in all direction thus radiation is the flow of heat from one place to another by means of electromagnetic waves radiation in daily life the cosmic radiation emitted from the sun is a mixture of electromagnetic waves which range from infrared to ultraviolet rays concept of temperature temperature is the degree of hotness and coolness of the body a yes, unit of temperature is kelvin for day to day application celsius is used temperature is measured with a thermometer temperature scales there are three types of scales fahrenheit scale celsius or centigrade scale Kel- kelvin or absolute scale these are the images for fahrenheit celsius and kelvin scale conclusion in conclusion the transfer of heat or thermal energy will typically change the temperature of the substance